This morning, Goodwill Amity held celebrations for their 85th anniversary in both Oakville and Burlington. I'm Kelly Duff and I'm the president of Goodwill. And as I always say on these occasions, I am wearing Goodwill. $8.99 last week at this store. Um, we're going to be introducing our distinguished guests in a moment and I look forward to hearing their remarks. But first I want to give a shout out to our volunteer leaders, our board of director members who are with us today. You won't be surprised to know that we had many and large events planned for our 85th and COVID has certainly changed those plans. But Goodwill Amity was formed to bring the community together during hard times. So being with our community now, even if in a smaller way, is very important to us. I want to share a little bit of our history. Amity was founded in 1935 in Hamilton as a social club for men who were unemployed as a result of the Great Depression. Soon it evolved into an operation that refurbished used goods, giving the men who refurbished them skills, employment, and access to affordable clothing and housewares. You see a theme. So that was Amity. Goodwill was founded in 1902 in Boston by Edgar J. Helms, and he had two mottos that we still live by today. One is a chance, not a charity, and a hand up, not a handout. So in 1973, Goodwill and Amity came together and we became Goodwill Amity. And throughout our history, we have consistently supported employment in Hamilton and Halton and operated used goods stores, which are now super popular as a social enterprise uh, that still provide uh, training, employment and value. And I would say that in 2020, we also really recognize our role in the upcycling and recycling ecology and we take that role very seriously. Through the pandemic, they also repurposed their transportation and catering operations to help numerous partners deliver more than 6,000 meals to those experiencing food insecurity. This is indeed a milestone. When you, re when you review all of the various ways that you've been part of our community, both in Halton and Hamilton, and the, and the way in which you've changed lives, transformed people's lives so that they actually have dignity and meaningful work, it makes a complete difference to someone's life and family when you're able to make a difference like that. And 85 years is a long time and I know that this organization will go on easily for another 85. One of the things that struck me and certainly many of you and my colleague MPP McKenna was that in this unprecedented time when we were dealing with the pandemic, how much people have actually striven to help neighbors to help friends, to help people they didn't even know, whether it's to deliver groceries, whether it's to help them find the medications that they need. Um, all kinds of ways in which our community has really shown that generosity of spirit. And that is in fact what you em emulate as an organization, a generosity of spirit that gives people an opportunity for a future. With the official anniversary being September 27th, the mayors and councillors have declared next week to be Goodwill Amity Week in both Oakville and Burlington. In his comments, Councillor Angelo Bentevenia acknowledged that many people know Goodwill as a thrift shop with great bargains. But the real big thing is the education that goes behind the scenes. Educate people that need um, like that hand up, that, that work uh, so that they can move forward in their lives and, and I personally have seen uh, a lot of the the benefits that they have done and uh, we're appreciative. It's, it's organizations like this that make Burlington a great place to raise a family. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley. Mm -hmm.